Welcome to PC Woods Kids Tech Talk. Today I have another neat Windows 7 tweak. This one here adds useful shortcuts to the My Computer Contacts menu. So you know this shortcut here, this menu uh, that you can right click on the computer icon and it appears and you can access things already on there. Well you can actually modify that menu and add things of your own. So let me show you how to do that, right? So I already added three things of my own here. I called it Clean Me Up show me the status and uh, update my OS. I created three shortcuts to do things that I wanted so I can quickly access them. So here's one of them. Clean me up just launches the clean manager in Windows. Um, the show me the status just opens up the task manager so I can quickly see the uh, tasks and get some information and the status and what's going on with the memory, for example. And um, the last shortcut that I created is update my OS just to quickly launch and access the uh, Windows update feature okay now you can add a whole bunch of different types of shortcuts in there but these are three useful ones that uh, I recommend doing by editing the registry so click on start or the or button and in the search field type reg edit and hit enter that will open up this registry editor now I know that this looks really confusing there's lots of uh, numbers and letters here it, it does um, have to be very specific you do have to navigate in the registry to this specific location and then in this location, which already exists, there's a shell folder. And under that shell folder, that's where you would create these three shortcuts. Okay, right now you will only see the find and the manage. Those are the two that will appear in there. So you can create as many new keys. These are the, that's what these are called, keys. And then associate a command for each one of those. So let me delete one and create it again. So I right click on shell, go to new, click on key, it puts in what it, okay what am I gonna call it call it anything you want okay it's, it's what's gonna show in your menu when you right click on that my computer icon on your desktop right so clean me up is uh, what I call the first one and then under that I have to create another new key so again I do a sub key there and then on that one I'm gonna just put in the word command all in lowercase okay and then once it creates that now on the right hand side it creates this default entry if double click on that default and put in the name of the exe that you want to launch. So cleanmgr.exe is the exe that uh, the executable that will launch the clean manager. Okay, so that's how I created that quick shortcut. It's in the system. Uh, it's accessible. You know, when you click on Start Run in Windows XP, for example, and you type in cleanmgr, it launches it. Right. So that's why I don't need to specify the full path and location on where this exists. It already exists in Windows. So it knows where to find it. So same thing for show me the status and update my OS. I just created these two new keys, called it whatever I wanted, but under that, those two command keys, right? So you have to create those two new sub command keys under those. That is specific, right? When you double click on each command, you have to put in the, the name of the executable. So task MGR is for the task manager and for the um, Windows Update, it's wuapp.exe, okay? And uh, that's how you can create your nice, neat little quick shortcuts to most commonly used things that are part of the Windows system, right? And uh, remember, it has to be under that specific path in the registry that I mentioned a second ago, so you'll have to um, expand and navigate down and drill yourself all the way to this specific spot, and then that's it follow the instructions and you should be okay all right um, it, there'll be more tips like this coming up soon but this one was really good for me I've been using it to create quick shortcuts so I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching